Hey Scorpio, hope you guys are doing amazing. We're going to go ahead and jump in and see what's going on with your person, someone that you have no contact, see if they're going to break the silence, okay? Um, welcome everyone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to see what's going on with you, how you feel about this person, and then we're going to jump into the, into the other person, okay? So we're going to start with you, Scorpio, and see how you're feeling, what you want. There goes the surprise. <laughs> You want a damn surprise. <laughs> Scorpio, it won't be a surprise if you want a surprise, okay? Let's put that back. <laughs> so, again, let's go ahead and see what is in your thought about this person, whoever's in your mind, Scorpio. And, and then we're going to move forward and then we're going to find out what they want, okay? So, and you can also flip-flop it however you want, right? Okay? So, let's go ahead and get started. So what is in your thought with this person? What is in your thought? What are you thinking? Okay, so we got the Eight of Swords. Hmm. So it could be a, Le a, a fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries, okay? What you're thinking is... You feel like this person is stuck or trapped in their mind. Maybe this person could be thinking very heavily. That's what you're thinking. Um, you want this person to have a clear conversation or some truthful um, conversation because the Ace of Swords is you speaking the truth, you know, speaking to you, telling you, you know, what you want to hear to be honest and truthful in the situation. Um, I do see that you have the four ones. This four ones keep coming out. So you have the full one. So in your thoughts is you would like to reconcile with this person, right? You would like to reconcile with this person, you know, and hope, hopefully maybe get into some type of commitment, but not right now. I feel like you want a reconciliation. Okay. So that's what's in your thoughts right now. What you're wanting, you want that reconciliation. And you want that communication. So you want this person to communicate with you and you want to have a reconciliation. You're waiting on this person to message you or to, to start, start something quickly, to come uh, about something quickly. You want this to move fast. Okay. I don't think your person can move that fast. I think your person is not is not someone that moves fast. But you you would like this to, to move a, a little quicker than one is what is going because you feel like it's very slow movement okay so what is the action you want them to take we got the ten of cups with the eight of pentacles wow and the ten of pentacles okay so the action you want them to take is get into some type of connection with you or happy family or stable connection or relationship, right? That's what you want. The eight of pentacles, you want them to start working in this connection. You want them to work. You want to work with this um, person and you're willing to put the time and the energy in this person as well. Mm -hmm. But you feel like they're stuck right now in another situation that they can't really get out of. Or that could be just an illusion of them being in their head about this and not coming com to communicate with you. Yeah. Because you're willing to have a reconciliation with this person if this person was to come and message you and communicate with you. The Ten of Cups is you're willing to go into a relationship with this person because you really have feelings for this person. You're willing to work together. So what, what are you expecting out of this relationship? We got the lovers. What are you expecting? reconciliation in the bottom the empress so you know your worth you know your worth you're not taking nothing less that's what you're saying you got the lovers and you got the moon could be a cancer or a gemini you're dealing with but you're not expecting nothing less and nothing you know your worth you know what you could bring to the table but 
the outcome, what you expect from this person is to tell you how they truly feel. To not keep secrets from you. To be honest, again, with the Ace of Swords. To be truthful. Oh, guys, this, my son made this for, my, for Mother's Day. <laughs> and my baby made this for Mother's Day. Okay, so I'm getting a lot of bracelets everywhere. Been blessed. All right. So, yeah, I just feel like, you know, what you're expecting is for this person to tell you that they love you. Right? The lovers. And that, you know, to show you some emotions or feelings here. Overall, you you in love with this person here, Scorpio. For some of you guys. I'm not saying everybody, so relax, okay? Don't jump through the phone. But you want you want to communicate with this person you want this person to communicate with you and you i think you are ready also you're ready to tell this person how you feel as well because a lot of you guys are going through a transformation you know what i'm saying i feel like the northern light i don't know if you guys are not feeling it but the freaking ascension is real okay the struggle of ascension is real if you're not getting headaches if you're not dizzy I mean, it's because, I mean, you have to be feeling this. You got to feel the energy, okay? I've been getting headaches, dizziness, and it's the ascension of the northern lights, okay? That, um, the solar flare, okay? So, it's a new energy, okay? It's a new energy that's coming in. We got Pluto and Aquarius. So, Aquarius, you know what I'm saying, the star, right? Everything is being balanced now, you know? The dreams coming true for a lot of people relationships coming together all right so this is how a lot of people's feeling okay you want your twin flame and it's because that's what you're feeling you you you're, you're expecting this okay because you can feel the energy you're feeling the whole energy see you feel the the magic that's in the air and a lot of you guys want to go ahead and reconcile a lot of you guys want to reconcile with this person. Well, you want to reconcile with your other half. And I get it. I get it, Scorpio. All right. So. All right. Let's see what's in their thoughts. What are they thinking about you, Scorpio? What they wanting? What's the action? What's the intention? And what's the outcome? So what they wanting for Scorpio? What they wanting? We got the devil, Capricorn. Mm -hmm. What's the action? Whoa! Two of Cups. What's the? <laughs> Hold on. What's that? It was the intention. So we have the world. So they probably closing out a cycle right now, or some type of comic cycle, because that was the world. Okay. Um. Eight of Cups, okay, so that's the intentions, the Eight of Wands, so it's pretty much the same thing, closing a cycle, walking away, yeah, your person could be in a hurt me right now, retreating from your energy, not talking, not communicating, you are not talking to this person, this person probably got you blocked, right, or they're blocking your energy or blocking your messages or something like that, I don't know, so what I do see in their thoughts is the Ten of Wands, they're definitely, they're feeling some type of burden right now, and I feel like at this very moment, they're about to be dropping the heavy burden, um, wasting their time. Yeah, wasting their time and taking up their business or responsibilities. This person is about to do the right thing, but not being, but this person is not being appreciated, doing the right thing for somebody else. I do see that this person works a lot for someone else. But not taking care of themselves. Okay. I feel like this person doesn't even. Like to feel like they need to. Clean the house. Or you know like. I feel like they. I feel like. Hold on. I'm getting a lot of messages. I don't feel like this person is happy. The way they live. Okay. Maybe they've been very um help a lot of people like people taking 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 from this person 
and not giving. Maybe this person is giving, 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 and maybe people are taking away from this person, and this person is feeling kind of deflated. It's like they wasted their time. Someone that's not really equal value with them or not put in the same type of energy or effort. So they dropping the burdens. People, places, and things that was, wasted, that was wasting their time. It could be a fire sign. We got the devil. So what they want, and they want is some passion. They want chemistry. They want sexual obsession. Maybe this person's not getting it with this other person. Maybe they're not, they probably unrequited love. Maybe they don't have the same passion chemistry that they feel for you, Scorpio. So this person has been lacking sexual love making or that connection, that passionate connection. Because the devil's obsession, you know, chemistry. Hmm. So this is why this person could be sexually frustrated. The action they want to take is being uh, is, is feeling a caring soulmate connection. Two of Cups wanting that soul to soul feeling, someone loving them, pouring their cup or pouring their heart, not their heart, but their love towards each other. Because look at how he's looking at her. And look how she's looking at him. Like, baby, you don't got to say nothing. I know exactly what you're saying. Or I know exactly what you're thinking. You know what I mean? It's like you and this person don't even need to speak to each other to understand each other. That's how crazy of a connection you guys have. So the intention is walking away. Eight of Cups. Walking away, not emotionally invested in this connection anymore. Finding the happiness elsewhere. So if you can see this person walking away from this other female, he's like, you know what? You know, we did what we had to do. We was together for a long time. You know, I just don't feel the same for you. Or, you know, I'm not in love with you. You know, that's a hard thing to say to someone that you've been with someone and you feel like, you know, you thought this was the love of your life or something like that. But when you realize you're awake and you're like, oh, I'm not in love with this person. It's like, okay, now I need to walk away. Like, I need to find happiness somewhere else. You're not giving it to me. Hey, you're not even giving me sex. What you talking about? So the outcome is the six of wands. This person is spreading their wings. They're spreading their arms. To have the victory. To be loved. To be acknowledged. To be wanted. To attract attention. But they want it with you, Scorpio. Okay, ten of ones. <laughs> I'm gonna take it like that. I'm gonna take it like that. Look, I can't make this up. I cannot make this up, guys. Four swords trying to rest, trying to regenerate, trying to cleanse his system, her system, trying to clean them house, trying to like have a spring cleaning. I, I don't know. I feel like after this break up with the situation with this other person i feel like this person is going to take the motivation and be like you know what i'm going to you know organize my house i'm going to organize my socks <laughs> i don't know some shit like that I, I feel like this person is going to take the initiative like you know what i need to do something to feel better and i feel like this person is going to be like i'm going to organize my clothes oh fuck it i'm going to clean the whole house i'm going to even scrub the walls that's how i feel because this person is going to want to feel clean you know, refresh, you know? So right now, they're resting, they're meditating, you know, they're trying to rejuvenate themselves, and they're having some type of mental clarity right now. 
You know, I, I'm not, I would put a past your person that they're meditating. Doing woosa, woosa. <laughs> but listen, so it wasn't their thoughts. It's the ten of ones dropping the burdens. Tired of uh, being taken uh, advantage of, right? The two of swords. Making the decision. Yeah, at first they were trying to make the right decision and they didn't want to. But now they're making the decision. Because at one point, they was in a crossroad. They're not in a crossroad no more. This is when they're in the crossroad. They can't, they're very indecisive. They don't know what they want. But it came out in reverse. They're not in a crossroad no more. They made a decision. The Six of Pentacles in reverse. Not giving to the situation anymore. Not giving to the situation. Not giving, give and take. Or whatever you want to call it. Not want to put no more time and effort. And not investing in the situation anymore. The devil. Wait. <laughs> Knight of Swords. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. The Page of Pentacles wanted to come out. Okay. Let's do it again. Hello. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Wait. All right. So, message is coming in. Be prepared because I feel like this person is going to send you a message once they get the shit together. Once they heal. Yep. You're about to receive a message, okay? You're about to, this person is about to reach out and talk to you and send you a message, okay? Because they are hurting, okay? They're hurting in this breakup, in this separation, in this pain. Maybe they could be hurting because they're not with you, right? So I feel like this person is about to reach out to you, okay? So I'm not going to say get ready, but it's going to be unexpected. The devil, the knight of swords, this person is coming with commu to communicate, okay? This person is coming to communicate, but... They being reckless and immature because they're going to let let you know something that they have in their mind, okay, or that they went through, okay. I, I do see the six of swords, so they are moving towards you, but again, this person is kind of like conflicted, thinking about it, okay. I don't think this person wants a commitment, which I don't know, you know what I'm saying, but the Knight of Cups is, this, they single. The Knight of Cups is single, happy, you know, having a healthy life, a healthy lifestyle again trying to clean <laughs> or you know trying to celebrate here okay this is fulfillment of abundance okay happy living your best life so i feel like this person is going to be living their best life once they let go of this other person that was a burden to them okay but i do see that the the action that they want is is, is a soulmate it's a soulmate they want you scorpio yeah the emperor Daddy is coming home. We got the page of one. Oh, good news coming in. This person is about to message you. They've been manifesting. They've been thinking about you. But they had not reached out to you because they had to clear something out in their life. All right, what's the two of cups? So daddy's coming home. Page of ones. You're about to get a message, a passionate message. Wanting to express love and their feelings towards you. Some of you guys are probably going to get proposed. Because he's, he's down on his knees. This is not for everybody, okay? <laughs> what is the Two of Cups? What's the Two of Cups? Oh. Yeah. So, you know, I feel like Daddy is about to send you a message. Page of Cups, Page of Wands. They're probably going to apologize for him by leaving you out in the cold. And not communicating to you and feeling leaving you um ghosting you okay um but i feel like they're going to explain something to you okay they were just up and they thought about this but they're going to explain to you they're going to send you a message and maybe you guys are going to sit down and communicate and talk about what happened why this person left you on the call okay because i don't think this is a bad person okay they're planning Okay, they're planning an event. This person is walking away from this other situation and they're planning. What else? Because I don't think that he did it, he or she did it on purpose. Okay? They just, at that very moment, they were tied up. They were tied up with something else. Page of Pentacles. More, more messages. 
Page of Cups, Page of uh, uh, Wands, Knight of Sword, Page of Pentacles. This is also an offer. Okay, so offering um, an offer of love, commitment, moving to a higher level of understanding and apology and maybe a gift. So maybe this is this person is going to plan to buy you some type of gift. Okay, Temperance could be a Sagittarius or a Capricorn. This person is definitely balancing out their they life. They're trying to be happier. They're trying to heal and be patient. And they're also working on themselves, okay? Also trying to protect themselves from becoming the devil. <laughs> I just saw this transitioning. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like this person has two sides. You got the devil and they... So this person could be a Sagittarius Capricorn cusp. Because you see how this person has two sides? You got the angel and the devil. Okay, so temperance is also the angel and the devil. So, <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, so this person could be a Sagittarius um, Capricorn cusp. Okay, so three of wands coming. King of swords coming to communicate. Fire sign. All right, what's the six of wands here? Damn. <laughs> Give me a minute. So, yeah. All right, so... This, this person could probably got a new job, okay? Maybe a new job, a new beginning. Maybe beginning in, in, in new money. Also commitment because I feel like this person's going to come and commit to you. Okay, what else? All right, I wanted the angels to take it out. What's the six of ones angels? Thank you. <laughs> Hierophant. Okay. Marriage, commitment, relationship, and eight of ones. So, baby, again, moving fast. This is going to move really quickly. This person was juggling with two people, two situations, but they made the decision. They're about to make that decision to come forward to tell you how they truly feel because they're sexually frustrated, Scorpio, but you make them hard. <laughs> you know what I'm... Mm, yeah, I just feel like you guys are going to be fucking all over the house. You made this person motivate to clean the house. I just heard... <laughs> You made this person motivate to clean the house because you guys are gonna fuck in the bathroom, in the in the bedroom, in the sala, which is the living room, maybe in the kitchen. Oh yeah, Scorpio, get ready because this person's coming for you. Are you ready for this? This person was fuck the shit out of you. Okay. That's mm. all right. Let's let's get into this. See what they what would they like to say to my Scorpio. What would you like to say to Scorpio? Come on, this person is watching you. They're about to chase you. So I do see reminiscing, maybe learning from the past mistakes. Now they want to come and make memories with you, Scorpio. Okay. I'm addicted to you. I'm addicted to your love. You know, that's what I was looking at, the devil. This person is addicted to you, okay? They are addicted to you, Scorpio. I do see that this person has some type of snake, some type of girl, a female that was very uh, jealous or envious of you, okay? Oh, yeah. What I said? Passion. Passion. You guys going to have passion. Um, insane chemistry. Like each other equally and having fun. Yo, you guys are going to be... You guys gonna be fucking i'm telling you i'm sorry but that's what it that's what somebody's thinking all right what else angels shit you got the passion card you got the ace of wands mm. you got the devil come on baby yeah somebody was feeling um stabbing the heart somebody stabbed somebody in the back heartbreak pain separation so this was shocking to this person now this person is like, okay, I can see right through you. Yep. They see clearly now. I can see clearly now. The rain is gone. Or the storm is gone. What else? Yeah, because they're in love with you, Scorpio. They're in love with you, baby. Half fame, love is coming. Surprise invitation. This person is about to invite you somewhere to go with them. Okay? Don't sleep with them, though. <laughs> All right, let's see what they would like to say to you with the hidden emotion. Okay, 
I have a dark secret that I don't want you to know. I hope you still love me the way I love you. This cop always comes out. All right. So what would they like to say to Scorpio? Don't. <laughs> what would they like to say to Scorpio? Oh. What would they like to say to Scorpio? Could be a cancer. Capricorn, Sagittarius. The comic is jealous because I told her I was in love with you. I told you. I told you this female, this jealous female is around. And maybe he did. She did tell him that he loves you. You could be a Taurus. Or could be a Taurus. What else, angels? I have trust issues with myself, so I push you away. Yeah. You know, sometimes when some, when somebody doesn't know their worth and they still dealing with somebody that always complains and take from them and is very codependent and they treat them like shit, that's where they go to because they feel like they don't feel worthy enough, right? You complete me in every way possible. Beautiful. And the bottom it says, you're so fucking sexy, I can't stop looking at you. You are all mine. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. the karmic has been putting black magic on me so maybe this person knows that the comic have been putting black magic give me one more juice could be a leo one more scorpio that's you scorpio one more give me one more capricorn so this person has cancer Capricorn, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio in their chart. Can you please forgive me? I love you. I want to work it out with you. I feel lost. I was molested as a child. I have daddy and mommy issues. Okay. Okay. I love your eyes. You have fuck me eyes. I told you. <laughs> All right, guys. So I'm going to leave it there. Make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe to the channel. I hope this resonated with you. And I see you in the next one. Remember, God loves you. I love you too. Bye, guys.